Greetings, me people. This is your girl, Mag Blizz the Empress. If you don't want to call me that, call me a little girl in a circle. If you don't want to call me that, call me reggae physician. We want you to take part in this year's Orange Friday Carnival. You're going to be fire. You have to represent. Me people, represent. Now, let's out. Hello there. So it's all about the Orange Friday 2022 edition. We are inviting all of you from everywhere across the 16 regions of Ghana to celebrate. It's going to be fire. It's going to be massive. You know, it's been three years since we celebrated. So this year, it's going to be yeah, Orange Friday. Hey, what's good, everybody? Thank you for checking me out. My name is Eko Simpson. If this is your first time of checking out my videos, kindly subscribe to this YouTube channel. I told you, I've been saying it, that this year we are looking at discovering Central Region. I made a post on social media informing my friend that, hey, this is what me, my team, and the others want to do. And then, I mean, it was like, everybody was like, okay, Eko, that is beautiful. We want to support you do this. Recently, before you get certain information running around, you either listen to the radio or watch TV or read from online. Today, I am here in one of the traditional ways of sharing information. Yes, uh, when I'm teaching ICT or computing in school, uh, there's this subject uh, where we call sources of information. You can get it from the internet, from the TV, and from the radio. In Central Region, Cape Coast, we have about, how many radio stations do we have? Uh, about uh, 13. About 13 radio yeah. stations. And uh, one of them that I started listening to because they started with Urban, uh, Kip FM. Kip FM was like one of the stations that I used to listen and I still listen to Kip FM. Uh, for the past five years, there's been something beautiful that this station has been doing. Let me tell you about it. Here in Cape Coast, every year, September, we celebrate our festival. We call it Fetu Afashe or Ugwa Fetu Afashe Festival. And now, there's this beautiful event that happens within the festive season, which everybody calls Orange Friday. Those of you watching me from Europe, I know somewhere in Germany or Norway, or there's a country like that that has this similar. Which which it's country? Holland. 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 Yeah. Okay, so Holland has this uh, similar program or carnival, like what we are going to talk about right now, in Central Region Cape Coast. There is a radio station which I just introduced you to that does a similar program called Orange Friday. So Orange Friday basically is a carnival that begins from one point to the other with about 5,000 people across the country. And let me tell you what, that is not only from Cape Coast or Central Region, it is from across the country. But last year, we were not able to celebrate yeah, about two years ago. Two years ago. Uh, beautiful. So two times we've not celebrated Ugafe to Afasha, which includes Orange Friday. So I have here with me the manager of Cape Afe. Uh He's a good brother. We've been moving around for some time now. And I was like, hey, this is one of the beautiful things that I think my subscribers who would love to move to Ghana or visit Ghana within the year and make sure you come within September because this is where the fun is. So I have here with me the manager of this radio station. So I'll allow him to introduce himself and say a little bit about this radio station. All right, uh, cool. thank you very much. My name is uh, Papa Nunas uh, Dadio, or you can call me the son of the town. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, Keep performing, I've been uh, in existence, I think about 10 years. Okay. Yeah, we started on Friday from 2013 up to date. So it's, it's if not about, um, not for the 20, 20, um, 29, um, 21, it will be around that 10. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But still, it's around that 10 because, you know, due to the pandemic, the COVID 19 pandemic, uh, that's why the orange didn't come on. But every year we had it, uh, we make sure as a video station, we make it an obligation for the orange to come on. So this year is, is, is coming on. Okay. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about Orange. What is Orange Friday? What is it? Okay. Um, Orange Friday is a road party where we make friends, uh, people, you know, make business because festival is business. Mm -hmm. People make business. So, you know, making my, you know, some, you know, you, can, you, you meet someone mm -hmm. that you fall in love with, you know, meet someone that 
you make business with yeah. you see and uh, we allow uh, people to bring their product to you know yeah. come and sell as well as bits what they have you know what they do show us what they do and it supports a lot of brands because we have a brand probably uh, put it on our, our low beds when they are going people uh, what is this you know and then oh yeah, these people do this and that so it's, it's a road party okay. that will exhibit a lot of things mm -hmm. that goes on the uh, drumming traditionally mm -hmm. and a little touch of you know some afro pops certain things you know it's, it's just a road party a road party a road party yeah so a road party that involves everything everything everybody Okay. The good ones, not okay. the bad ones. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so for some time now, I've realized that um, Orange Friday is being patronized by a lot of people. Yeah. From a food to from where? Where do you think people come from? I mean, within Central Region, just Central. <sighs> that one there, I can't just uh, guess though, but uh, it's simple, amazing. You know, we start. A few people will be around, but when we keep going, Charlie, you won't see where the people will come from. <laughs> That's what I've, I've tried to, you know, just to think of where those people come from. But mm -hmm. I, I, I'm, I'm just, uh, you know, thinking about where they come, they come from. But I can't just say that they come from here, there. But I know it's something that uh, the Ghanaian people love it. Mm -hmm. When you go to Gogo, go, go, is the best carnival in West Africa? Oh, it's yes. Orange Friday. It is Orange Friday. So it's not me really saying it's by when you go, go, go tell the best carnival because the, the, those that come, the kind of the numbers, Charlie, uncount, uncountable, yeah. uncountable. You, you, you won't see the starting, you won't see the ending, mm -hmm. but you'll see people. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Beautiful. Beautiful. So, um, like he's saying, it's a road party where we start from one point to the other. So basically, uh, mm -hmm. this is what happens during the festival season here in Cape Coast. Now, let's talk about Orange Friday in 2022. Yeah. What is going to be so different with Orange Friday 2022? Uh, okay, Orange Friday 2022, you know, initially, when we start from uh, the float, we got to town, it's, it's about two kilometers, mm -hmm. you know, from Cape Coast North to Cape Coast South. So mm -hmm. by the time, they, you know, we get to town, everybody's tired, you see, then we despite them. But this time around, we, we, we do a closing jamboree okay yeah i'm trying to uh, bring this orange invasion mm -hmm. on a comps night mm -hmm. so that people will come you know come and have fun know people the visit to come you know sort out with some you know yeah. uh, people businesses everything should be going on mm -hmm. you see so that's one thing we are adding up the orange invasion all right so this time you are talking about the orange invasion where you are going to really teach people to you know understand what happens during the outcomes night yes. and how they can also you know participate in that. Yeah. So aside that, what else are you going to do this year? So aside that we have a, a, a cooking competition okay. within the radio stations in, uh, in, in Central Region, Cape Coast mm -hmm. and me myself I'm a good chef. Okay. Yeah I'm a very good chef. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So uh, we haven't started yet but I have to declare myself a winner because uh, with the other stations they don't know how to cook. Me myself, I know they don't know how to cook. But me, I know, I know, how, I know how to cook. <laughs> yeah, so yeah. wait, 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 wait. Yeah. So we are calling on all the radio stations yeah. in Cape Coast. Yeah, it's a because that you of Cape FM is yeah. saying that they're going to have the radio station food bazaar, whereby this radio station must bring people to come and cook. Simple. And then you will represent your station. Yes. Because you are the best cook. I'm the best. Cook. Okay, so as I see radio. ATL, uh, Castle. Castle Live, Benya, okay, Benya is yes, over FM. there. Yes, FM, Igil FM. FM. Joe, you guys should prepare for DJ Dabio. He says the best group from Cape FM. So, uh, what we're talking about right now is this um, event that happens during uh, September in Cape Coast, where we celebrate the festival. So, on the Friday before the Grand Deba, which is a Saturday, there is a road party, a road party. So, so um, let me let me ask this. I, I have, a, I mean, people who are coming to Ghana, Central Region, Cape Coast, in September, and they would like to take part in this uh, Orange Friday. What message do you have for the brothers and sisters from the diaspora who would love to come and experience the Orange Friday? They should come to Cape Coast um, this coming 
It should start from the August uh, 29th, mm -hmm. and then uh, up to um, 3rd um, September. Mm -hmm. Then will be the day back for the work with transportation. But yeah. the one Friday is on the 2nd of September. Mm -hmm. I just encourage everyone to come and witness that this year's Orange Friday for the work with transportation. You should come with your families, friends. Mm -hmm. Just they should get them informed that hey, we are going to Ghana yes. and we are going to Cape Coast, Central Region, to precise, and we are going to Abra. Yes. With Abra, Cape Coast, Abra, you know, down to witness Orange Friday and Buffalo Transportation. So they should all come. Screeches are short mm -hmm. because um, we have the regional police commander Alex, DCOP Alex, and, and the two IC ACP Coffee to uh, ensure us full security with the full ambu policemen. Uh, I'm going to make sure that security is very tight. Okay. So uh, I'm encouraging everyone to come. Uh, to this year's Orange Friday 2022. All right, beautiful. So, hey, thank you very much for checking us out. This is just a bit of what is going to happen in July, August, and September. And I promise you, we're going to bring you something beautiful from Cape Coast. So, there's a slogan that they say when it's Orange Friday. So, say, okay, let's see how we can do this together. You know what I say? Orange. Then you see Friday. So let's do it. Okay, so wait, 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 wait. So okay. this is what we're going to do. We are going to say it and then we will leave the response for you to put it up in the comment section. Yeah. So we will say orange Joe, then you will have to say Friday. So ready, go. Orange Joe. Thank you for checking me. I'll put it up as I comment. Peace. <laughs>